You let us out of Atlanta with no thought for yourself. Do you remember that night? I can't tell you how grateful I am to you, Shane. You know I can never repay that debt. The thing to know. Thank you. You're Fort Benning, you reckon? Fort Benning. I should have listened to you, Shane. It would have saved us a lot of grief if I had. And you're right. Could I ever run? I know you, Shane, well enough to know that there is only one surefire way of engaging you in a conversation. And that is to start asking you about girls you did in high school. I don't want to, but I'm willing to do it if that's what it takes. Mary Ann, you used to live for those details back in the day. Yeah, I was impressionable. <laughs> and I may have been living vicariously through you. Hmm? What 30 year old were you banging in high school? PE teacher? Mr. Daniel. <laughs> Mrs. Kelly. <laughs> the girl's volleyball <laughs> coach? Wasn't she married? <laughs> oh, come on. It's time for you to come back. Thank you. You got it. You know, I tried to get you out. Let me get you out of here, buddy. I tried, but we weren't going to make it. Man, there was no way, and I knew it. But I couldn't live with him. My friend. His name was Shane. <laughs>